So, we are going to be playing Fallout 4 today. Uh, apparently, they are working on an upgrade. Oh my gosh. Update. They're working on an upgrade for the PS5, but that's not going to be out till next year. And I didn't feel like waiting. So, <laughs> this is what we're playing today for Twitch Miss. But uh, some games get this boost. Some PS4 games get a boost. If you play them on PS5, there's a, there's a handful of them. Um, and apparently Fallout 4 is always going is also going to be one of them. But not until next year. So we won't get any of the <laughs> any of the benefits for that. But that's okay. Didn't realize there was going to be such a long update. <laughs> but uh, you know, here we are. So, new game. Let's do it. And hope that we don't come across copywritten music. War. War never changes. Is that what this meme has been from this whole time? In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army. He said that he did say it. He'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. How does he know he that son's his, his, then? Maybe when it's the, the mailman. US ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, Holy shit, that thing's big. I'm supposed to wear that century, everywhere? People awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. Who is that? <laughs> is it supposed to be your player character? Because I'm not going to be this man. All the songs on the radio station. You're gonna knock him dead at the veterans hall tonight, hun. You think? Absolutely. No. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. Um, no. I don't want to be you. Hey, my turn. Get out of the guy. way. I want to be me. That's the male player character voice. So it was a character that we aren't, basically. It has nothing to do with us, that opening. That's fine. I guess. <laughs> I laid a facial feature. Oh, God. Well, let's start with the hair. Uh, correction. All the songs on the radio stations are still under copyright as far as I can understand. So do not turn on radios at all. Okay. I can turn. I, I think I can turn off 
or turn the volume down the whole way, but I don't know if there are any radio stations that are just talking. Like, I don't know if I need that. Oh, God. We're already starting off terribly. Oh, no. Young at heart. A ponytail? Oh, dear God. This femme fatale? In what universe? Oh, my God. Well... Yeah, rough night. That We might end up going with that one, because this is already a rough night. With that hair, she kind of looked like Emma Watson for a second. Anyway, that's kind of rude to Emma Watson, though. Sorry, Emma Watson. I know you're watching. Um, Wendy the Welder. I can't even see. Turn your head, Wendy. Eh. 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 I just... You hate the hair. <laughs> which one do you hate? Tell me which one. Because saying I hate that hair does not narrow it down. In the slightest. Oh my god. This is it? That's the... Okay. Well, we're starting off terribly. Um. Uh, I guess we're going to go with this one or this one. This one. Blonde, Look, I don't have a purple. I shut up, husband that now looks way older than me cuz I accidentally changed your features. Um Yeah, all of them are bad, but you know, we're going to do what we can. We're going to do what we can. Can we divorce this man yet? I hope so. I mean, we could just go with like super We could just go with super white hair. That's why you love modding the game. I don't blame you, Kotana. Uh, you turned him into a dirty old man. I didn't try to. Eyelids top, eyelids bottom. This is a lot. Um, I kind of wish these were just normal sliders. This is a little cumbersome. Um, so what are our options? Such pretty eyes. Shut up. <laughs> You're not involved in this. Red. Uh, no, not hair. Go back. This is already oh, a yeah. disaster. Yeah, that works. Oh my god, shut up. Okay. Here we go. That. There's not a lot here. Are there no contacts in the future? These are all boring. I wanted to give myself like red eyes or yellow or something. <sighs> oh, I hope the music in the background isn't copywritten. I just realized. Sean totally right. has your eyes. Well, we're going. I can't even hear what you're saying to me right now, sir. Oh, skin tone. Not bad. See, it's kind of hard Not to like bad at all. pick mouth bottom, mouth top. I was gonna try to put on lip color, but I guess that's not allowed. I'm barely seeing any changes in this mouth. We can't all be Sith Lords. <laughs> No, I guess we can't. What is type? You oh, there we go. Chin. There's there's different uh, shapes, I guess. Oh, yeah, I like that. This is getting creepier. It's getting creepier. Um. Are you staring at those lips too? Or is that just me? I'm already annoyed with this man. These are... I feel like our best bet is nice. almost default in most of these. You know? I don't think... They still had radioactive lipstick back then. This is in the future!
if you've been crying and your makeup runs and you like rub your eyes definitely not the same thing husband like stressed out he's stressing me out besides this is the only customization I can do the rest of the customization is kind of annoying so let me have this dramatic makeup okay let me have this. Uh, I don't want that. Could go matte. Hmm, that changes the color quite a bit. Leave, let me make her goth, okay, Umbreons? <laughs> let me live my Absolutely life. Absolutely lovely. We love Fallout 4. Play this with mods to make the game play better. Well, we definitely could have better hair. The original goth. We demand more goth options, Bethesda. That's right. <laughs> This with this, like, this dress looks ridiculous. Oh, well. Those markings. Oh, freckles. Mm, no. What is damage? Just, like, big old scars, I guess. Dude, this one makes me look like it in fights all the time. We should probably go with that. Then we can intimidate people. I feel like that's definitely something we should do. Like, maybe one through the eyebrow. Now, what is this Joker one? Has anyone made the Joker in this game? All right, we're going with the eyebrow, I think. That looks no, nice. No, I have to keep pressing apply and not just X. Here we go. Embrace your goth audience, Bethesda. <laughs> Why do you keep removing it? I applied it. Apply. Except. My beautiful wife. There we go. Uh, thank you, Disney Dreamlight Valley, for updating. Oh my god, that outfit is hideous. Anyway. What if I'm just real jacked? Real jacked and real goth. <laughs> um, oh, whatever. Let's just do normal. I don't have time. I don't have time. We've already spent too long on this as it is. Yeah. Good enough. I'm going to turn my eyebrow and cut too deep. That's, um, that would be horrific. That's not really how that works. Oh, well, this is, this is our old husband. It's fine. Why don't you see if breakfast is ready? It's fine because, um, he definitely is going to live, um, through this game. So it's fine. Mr. Handy. The incredible multi-talented. Mr. Handy sounds like a robot that g would give you a hand job, and I don't think that's what he does, but that's what it sounds like Let he Codsworth does. Let take care of it. Another fine product of General Atomics International. Can I take this? No. Why is this open? I can't pick up anything? It's an extra add-on. Okay, well, just to be safe, we're just going to turn that radio all the way down. Turn the voices up, turn the music down. And I'm going to turn up the sensitivity a little bit. Okay. Good morning, Mom. Your coffee. 
Not your mom. Drognak the Barbarian and the Jungle of the Bat Babies. <laughs> okay. She's just gonna laugh. Is there no way to turn on subtitles? That seems odd in display. There we go. Hmm. Let's make that blue. We can probably make it purple. Too purple, too purple. Maybe like there. There we go. Robot Alfred. His name's Codsworth. Hey, Codsworth. Enjoy your coffee, pup. Okay. New Coca Cola. Ice cold. Looks like the milk got delivered. Saddle up Salisbury oh, steak. Like Rated A. Plus. I shall attend to young Shaw. <laughs> Good, because I'm not going to. I'm glad we got Codsworth. Activate baby bottle. <laughs> How can someone so small drink so much? Well, are we sure that that's not his grandson? <laughs> if this is the future, why? Why is this our TV? We have a robot. We don't have color TV. Someone's outside. What's going on here? Oh no no no! No turn it off. I don't know why he keeps bothering. I might actually play music. We can't do that. Oh, I'm gonna sit. I'm gonna have a nice sit. I'm gonna have a nice sit. The microprocessor was never invented. This is a Fallout game. This is Fallout 4. Old daddy changed the diaper. Old daddy. Activate American flag. No, no one's home. No one's home. No one's home. I'm just in here. We were activating my camera. Photos developed. They spent too much money on the robot. They can't afford a color TV. Priorities. You need to get dressed twice. Oh, but our outfit's so ugly, though. Maybe if we ignore him, I'll go away. That was my thought. Maybe that's why I married this man. He also hates people coming to the house unannounced. Hello. What you doing here, Codsworth? Oh, you're taking care of the small child. He's still there. I'm kind of impressed. The little void is adorable. <laughs> Plot twist. It's not my kid. It's Codsworth's kid with my husband. You're special. I wonder what Sean will grow up to be. Isn't this how you leveled? You got skills in Fallout 3 when we played it? <laughs> to think one day he's going to learn how to drive. 
Maybe if we ignore him, he'll go away. <laughs> he'll either be great at spelling or great at smashing blocks together. I'll be sweeping up the floors later. Okay, thank you, Codsworth, for that announcement. Should get this sign next time we're at the park. What if I just close the door and then I don't have to He's deal with that? I'll give him that. Well, I have no reflection, so I guess I was a vampire all along. I knew it. So, fun fact, I did play a little bit of this a while ago. Like, years ago. And I don't remember much. But I do remember... That old husband is going to die. So spoilers sugar for bombs. you. You're welcome. One hundred percent daily value of sugar. He's persistent. This guy is still here. Oh my god! I'm gonna call the cops. Can I leave? Can I leave? We can live without him. Yeah, as long as we have our robot. I'm gonna drink my coffee. Can't see him. Can I jump or anything? Well, now I oh, know who's gonna give up triangle. Well, that's not what I expected. All right, we're looking outside. Mm-hmm. Oh, there he is. He looks like he's from LA Noir. Can I crouch? No button is crouching. I don't want any of what you're selling. Please leave. You can make me tell him to leave. Good morning. Can I shut the door in his face? Damn it. Uh, hello? I'm not interested. No offense, but no soliciting. Oh, no worries, ma'am. No worries at all. I'm not selling anything. Not you don't want your Girl you Scout cookie. You know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. No. Maybe I don't want to talk to you. No. Does it look like she wants to talk to you? You do. Now I know you're a busy woman, so I won't take up much of your time. Yeah, you know time. how long it took me to do this time eye makeup? Being, um, I'm very busy. A precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Go away. Uh, just go away. Won't take but a moment. We do need to verify some information to make sure you're cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of <coughs> total atomic annihilation. No. Come back some other time. Come on, hon. It's just a little paperwork. Let him fill Shut it up, out, Grandpa. And it's done. <laughs> I said no. I think you forgot what no means. Fine. I'll do it myself. Stubborn. I'm Splendid. divorcing you. Splendid. You don't listen to my concerns. Let's get to it. She's so pissed. Look at her face. She's so mad. Um... Hmm. Now, if I'm remembering correctly, there's a list of names that Codsworth will call you. So I want to see what those are. Let me look. Fallout Force Codsworth knows exactly 922 names. According to, uh, this. They did record a lot of names. Oh, come on, load. Alright. Let's see what we got here. 
Anything good? Alan. No, her name is not Alan. Hmm, I bet they don't have keto. Something tells me that they probably don't. They probably don't have keto. They do have bacon. Um, <laughs> I'm very tempted to name her Bacon. Batty? Surprising no one. They have Bob. They also have Boob and Booby? According to <laughs> this site? I'm glad that they are about as mature as I am. They have Buffy. We could be a vampire who's also a vampire slayer. They have Camilla. This could be our f <laughs> this could be our fates. Uh, you know, pre playthrough. <laughs> Cherry bomb. Clunk. Clunk and cob. Um, wow, that one. Alrighty then. Not Camilla! <laughs> Buffy could be fun. Buffy could be fun. Do they have Hilda? I'm in the seas right now, so hang on. <laughs> we're uh, we're working on it. They have Cox. So uh, there you go. They do have Bob. Okay, this list might be better. The other one was also giving me like sound bites. Can you load? Mud guts? Are you- is that one? <laughs> is that one, Dalton? Oh, Cummings. Well... <laughs> that sounds about right. Death? We could just be called Death. I like that. Fucker, fuck face, and fuck. <laughs> Hilda's not on here. Bummer. I'm very disappointed. Death sounds perfect. <laughs> All right. My name is Death. I mean, she's already done with this man, so I could see her writing that where the name is. <laughs> it's just, it's a lie this whole time. All right, chat, where should we put, where should we put our points? I feel like charisma is usually a good option, but what do you guys think? I am not well-versed in Fallout. No, my name was not on that list, unfortunately. Codsworth could call you sexy. <laughs> I remember when I played this before, I, m I named myself Badass so that Codsworth would say that. Death is definitely charismatic. Depends if you want to go melee or guns. Oh, I don't know. I do agree with Umbreon's, though. Death is pretty charismatic, I would say. We should probably put some points in charisma. It really doesn't matter in four. Oh. Someone's been cheating on her husband with Mr. Andy. <laughs> they gutted the special system for the atrocious leveling system. Oh, so these aren't these don't really matter. Okay, well, in that case. Um, we'll be smart. 
I'm just gonna kind of, um, we're just gonna YOLO it then. Give one more point to Charisma. Um, yeah, I figured Charisma would have to do with dialogue, so I wanted to get a few points in there. They have minor impacts, and then you just level them up anyway later. Oh, okay. Well, let's do Endurance 2. Good enough. I'm not using the Companion app now. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, Get out. Thanks again. Hey, yes. <laughs> it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have it's a lie. Limits. Why do we have a pet food, like a dog bowl? Where's Sean our dog? Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that maternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> Go ahead, honey. I think the robot's malfunctioning because that's just okay. not true. I'm going to feed the dog. <sighs> Never going to find that dog. What the fuck? Great, so my in-game dog ran away? Why is that necessary? <laughs> Why did they put that in the game? <laughs> Can we trade the kid for the dog? That's a good question. Maybe that's why the dog ran away. He didn't like the kid. Hey. Hey. I wish I could name him, too. Maybe I could have. I mean, I did accidentally make him very old. Um, Why don't you go in there and take care of the child? Hey, hon. That's definitely your kid and not mine. Just going to stand on the couch and watch TV as you do. Riveting. I've had this game for five years now and never noticed the dog bowl. Don't name him like a Pokemon rival. He's gonna get a Mr. Handy first. Uh, I don't know if you'd want a Mr. Handy from this. Sean requires your personal attention. A little motherly love to quiet the nerves. I feel like a dishwasher would have been cheaper, but Codsworth. Now don't you touch the laundry. <laughs> Fine. Hello, child. My boy isn't giving his mother any trouble, is he? Hey, where the hell did you come from? Crib the other day. Why don't you give it a spin? I already did. Where were you? Maybe if you were around more and not on the couch, maybe you would have seen that I already spun it. That's my boy on his best behavior, just like his dad. Well, most of the time. Anyway. Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Halloween prep? Is it Halloween? Let's get pumpkins instead. Carve jack-o'-lanterns. Yeah, that's what Death would say. Mom, <laughs> you should come and see this. Cotsworth, what now? I don't have time for a handy. Oh, I can't spin it anymore. Well, bye, child. All right, let's go. Followed by, yes, followed by <laughs> flashes, blinding flashes. Look, you aren't Sounds the fuck. Explosions. <laughs> We're uh, trying to get confirmation. Oh, shit. We seem to have what? lost contact with what our affiliate say? stations. Oh, no. We do, we do have, we do have coming in. That's, um, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. What? My God. I'm in Pennsylvania. That's scary. What's going on outside? Oh my God. We need to get to the vault. Now! Let's go. How'd you get him so fast? Uh, can I at least take my coffee? What if I just don't go? Hey, God's God, what if we don't go? Stay safe, honey. And your family as well, Mom? Oh, my. I'm just not gonna take my robot with me? And the dog is lost. Well, you know, before we do that, I should put on more eyeliner. <laughs> I don't want everyone in the vault to see me without my full eyeliner. 
Um, yeah, so what if we just don't go, though? They're not going. They're just standing there. Maybe they didn't get a um, solicitor telling them. It would be funny if you took too long, you got nuked, but I don't think that happens. Ah, does Residents it? Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. Only if you're registered. That's pretty shitty. The rest of you have fun <laughs> getting blown up. Hmm. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. Listen, I need to find my dog. How about I go back to bed? This would be a good time to loot. Can I loot other people's houses? Nah. The nukes are coming. Those communist bastards. This is it. This is the end. Uh, I'm sure we'll all be fine. I'm sure we'll be fine. Oh my god. Excuse me. What if we can't we drive don't have any room for the car. Hey. We we'll have to avoid the highways. Everyone's going to be taking them. Take the tricycle. Char guess where you are. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. Oh, I want these flamingos. Can I take the flamingo? <sighs> the game not letting me pick up items is very disappointing. Residents I'm sure I will be Hills. later. If you are registered, evacuate Once we're out of the prologue, but you know. Maybe I want to pick up items now. Maybe I wanted to take those flamingos into the vault. Did you ever think about that, Bethesda? No, you didn't. me as a ghoul or something <laughs> Codsworth stay safe honey and your family as well mom oh my dang it well there you go now you know for sure that you can Residence get <laughs> destroyed <laughs> I'm still mad that I'm not taking Codsworth with me I'm just leaving him there Hold on, oh my god, there's Grandpa. What? Didn't you leave way before me? Where were you? Oh man. Cogsworth is the only one you love. What about death? You don't love death? That's absurd! You don't get in. I'm going in. You can't stop. Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 okay, okay. That guy? I See, that's what you get for soliciting. If you're in the program, step forward. Otherwise, return home. We're not in the vault program. Oh my god, we're gonna die. Tell me if you're registered. We need to get in. Hey, uh, my name's we're Death. On I'm on list. the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Wow. Okay. Go Very, ahead. Uh... Thank you. Good luck, sir. You two, follow me. Come on. Out. What's gonna happen to all those Step people outside We're the gate? We're doing everything we can. Now keep moving. Hello. Yeah, that's kind of fucked. They're like, well, only a few of you. We didn't even give him any papers. We didn't. I mean, we all love death. Panic and adrenaline are moving his old bones. <laughs> Step on the platform in the center. 
so what if I'm actually the Grim Reaper and that's why my name is Death and I'm just waiting. <laughs> I'm just biding my time with this. It's okay. He's together. fine. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Oh my god! Uh, <laughs> You actually set off the bomb. Shh, 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 <laughs> Don't tell the Mumbrians. I guess I should stop going by death or people are going to get suspicious. We did it. We made it. We're okay. Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. Pretty sure radiation no doesn't care worry, that you're folks. going down, Mr. Handy. <laughs> situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just. Yes, um, I can't believe it. I'm not sure about that. A minute later. No, we no. don't be. Don't get caught up thinking about that. You're safe now. Everyone, just head up these She just pushed me out of the way. Excuse me. What? what? What's going on? Oh. <laughs> Hey, I hope we'll you brought fine. extra underpants for him. As soon as the world stops spinning. <laughs> She's over it. Hey there. Up the stairs. Up the stairs, please. Hey. Head inside. Just up the stairs there. They're probably regretting saving me. As they should. Hello. S excuse me. Hello there. Once we seal the vault, we'll all be getting to know each other a lot more, I'm sure. Mm mm hmm. Hello. Good. Just me taking forever to get in here, <laughs> stopping to talk to everyone. Excuse me. Just step over to the table. Why? Uh, that's not creepy, right? You gonna take your suit? No. Well, it actually looks a lot better than what I'm wearing. So yes, give me it's that. It's down the Thanks. hallway right there. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right. I don't want to follow a doctor a follow. anywhere, anytime. See? Hey. Hey, neighbor. Waiting this is forever. Home. Excuse oh, me. You're gonna love There's some problem. This is luggage. one of our most they're, they're advanced facilities. Not what do you have in there? You. Drugs? Probably. Can I have another one? Excuse me. Down that hallway, they'll show you where to go. Please burn my clothes. Thank you. All right. Oh, hey, hey what's up? Hun? <laughs> how you how you holding up? <laughs> They took their robots. They do. They put them in the suitcase. <laughs> it's gone. Our home. Everything we had. My mother and father down in D.C. Ma'am. Oh God, honey. What if they didn't make it? I know. Mm, this is a well, I'm death, time, and I could tell you if they did or not, but I'm not sure you want the every answer. Every step of the way, you'll thrive here. Yeah, I bet we be won't. Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. At least this outfit makes your butt look hot. Yeah, the one right now is not doing anything for me. The suit is designed to be fashionable as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future. Well, I I'm just checking don't know if I go that far, but... As they come in. Hey there. A lot of names to process. I'm glad so many people made it. Only certain people, though. Everybody else was left to die. Such a lovely family you have. I hope you'll see this as your new home. <laughs> She's like your son, your grandfather. <laughs> hey, what you doing in there, Mrs. Callahan? Hey. Oh, close call, huh? And to think I thought building the vault in the neighborhood was a bad idea. 
Mm, it probably was. Hey! That elevator. So slow. Why Just is it moving here and so and weird? Put your vault suit on. It'll be okay. Mommy's right here. See? Honey? What? Oh, yeah. Could you help me? What? Oh, fine. Who is my little guy, huh? I'm not going far. The, the, it's, he's a baby. Just he doesn't. Be over there. I don't think he can comprehend that we're going into there. cryo. See? Mommy's not going far. The mommy's just gonna go freeze. Inside, it's fine. Put on your vault suit. I don't want to put on my vault suit in front of all these people. You got a changing room? I don't know how to put on my vault suit. Oh. Did I? I already did, I guess. Didn't mean to wear my flat ass pants in nuclear annihilation. Nah, I wanted to dress cuter for this. For a whole new life. Resident secure. I think it's interesting that they just let him hold the baby. Occupant vitals. Normal. Procedure complete. Yeah, they just put the baby in with the husband. Or the like whichever. The spouse. Man, I hope I wore a thick bra. This is the one. Here. Open it. But what's going on over here? Well, Sean is unthawing. Almost. Everything's gonna be fine. What was that about? At least we still have the backup. Cryogenic sequence. Well, um, I told you Grandpa wasn't gonna make it. I really don't know what happens with the kid. I have not gotten that. I never got that far. I only played for a little bit, so I don't actually know what, uh, what story uh. relevance this has, but. <laughs> Being called the backup sounds super sketch and creepy. Yes, it does, because then it's like, what, backup for what and why? We must just have really good jeans. They're Levi's. All right. Um, hey, honey. You okay? Come on. There has to be a release. Yeah, it's right there. Nope, I can't get him out. Well? Come on, come on, come on. Oh, there we go. Oh, God. I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. There's no... I promise. There's no evidence of him being shot, though. Is there? Time to loot his corpse, Umbreons. Can I? Um, no. I can just look at his crotch and remember our times together. Um. So yeah, this would actually be pretty freaking terrifying. Being one of these pods, and everyone's dead, I guess. Oh god. Except me Why somehow, because I am this? the protagonist. Override. 
I took his wedding ring? Well, at least, at least we have that. This is very creepy. I need a coat. Seems cold in here. Well, we wanted to divorce. Happily single again. Yeah. Um. So, like, how long were we frozen, though? My question is, if we were frozen for a couple years, then our kid is going to be potentially older. Death heavy breathing. Um, oh yes, I will take that and that, and, uh, the toolbox said nothing. If there's one thing you need to know about me, it's that I am a hoarder and I will take everything. I don't know what I'm going to use this hammer for, but I'm taking it. Is it a weapon? I don't even know, but I'm going to take it. 200 years. Oh, well, then, uh, maybe our son is dead, too. I feel like our son might end up being the villain somehow. I don't know. He could be, like, an... Ew? He could be an adult and the villain. Seems about right. Ha ha! Well, I found this. How do I... Whoop, there we go. Safety first. Well, uh, it's a little late for that, isn't it? Oh. Welcome to Robco Industries. Security instructions. Confidential, confidential, confidential. Security eyes only. Vault 111 is designed to test the long-term effects of suspended animation on unaware human subjects. Well, that's fucked. Security staff are responsible for maintaining installation, integrity, and monitoring science staff activity. Under no circumstances are staff allowed to deviate from assigned duties, insubordination, or interference with vault operations or capital offenses. Security staff are authorized to use lethal force. I think security staff is dead. But, uh, so yeah, I guess this whole thing was just to test how humans would respond to cryo. Um, badly would be the result, I would say. Resident admittance. Upon activation notice from Vault Tech, all personnel are required to report to the entry area and assist with admittance of Vault residents. Security personnel will maintain order and ensure that no personnel or residents attempt to evacuate the Vault. Research staff will be responsible for resident intake and escort each to the designated cryogenic pod. Residents not accounted for in the manifest should be asked to step aside and detained forcefully by security if necessary. Once all residents have been sealed into their preservation chambers, dispose of any detainees Vault entryway must remain sealed under any circumstances. Pretty much every vault is a different experiment. This is the ugliest computer ever. <laughs> um. Well. Science staff. M members of the research team must daily monitor the vital signs of cryogenically preserved residents. Cardiopulmonary and cognitive activity in particular must be recorded hourly. Life-saving life intervention is only permitted if greater than 80% of the resident population has perished while in cryogenic suspension and must not interrupt suspension. Independent research is encouraged and left to the overseer discretion. Security patrols are to be carried out on a constant eight-hour rotation. Security priorities include... Monitoring for signs of intrusion, checking for atmosphere leaks, settling disputes among personnel, enforcement of regulations set forth by the overseer, enforcement of regulations set forth by the Vault Tech. Due to the nature of Vault 111, personnel will be expected to perform duties outside of their normal qualifications, such as janitorial duties and food prep. The exact distribution of these roles is left to overseer discretion. All clear message. Following a nuclear event, Vault Tech will monitor hazards such as radiation levels, enemy invasion, <laughs> subsequent attacks, and other factors. Once conditions are deemed safe, this terminal will receive an all clear notice. Upon receiving the all clear notice, Vault Tech personnel may be evacuated at overseer discretion. Disregard any notices from organizations or individuals not associated with Vault Tech, including government and military. Residents are not to be disrupted or evacuated. Vault Tech will attend to their needs remotely. Once Vault 111 staff has been evacuated. 
Vault 111 is classified as a short-term assignment. Non-resident personnel are expected to carry out research duties and basic maintenance of the vault while awaiting the all-clear signal to evacuate. In the absence of an all-clear message from Vault Tech, the overseer may elect to evacuate staff after a mandatory shelter period of 180 days of containment. Under no circumstance may Vault 111 staff evacuate during the shelter period unless receiving the all-clear message from Vault Tech. Now we've got a couple security logs. Okay, so the year was 2077 before Halloween, if you recall. So it looks like it's been at least a year, um, potentially longer, but God, it finally happened. The world's over. Barely got all the residents inside. Not everyone made it. Now it's just us and the icebergs. I don't get it. Eggheads tried to explain to me that keeping them frozen is a big experiment. For a better future or something? I don't know. It just doesn't seem right that we were smiling at them all the time before putting them on ice. Shouldn't we have told them something? I mean, ethically, yes, you should have, but, um... Christmas Underground. See, this is a Christmas game. Got together with the rest of the security boys and support staff and had a little party. Best gift that got handed out was a fancy lad snack cake that wasn't too stale. None of the scientists came. Overseer wasn't there either. I just don't get them. They hiding something from us? Another company secret only for the higher ups? Whatever, just a few more months until the all clear is supposed to come through, then we can start rebuilding. Well. Only a few weeks left in our mandatory shelter period. Everyone's getting stir crazy. Some people are even saying the all clear signal is never coming. We can't stay here much longer, that's for sure. It's not just the fact that I've been staring at the same break room and bunk bed for over six months. It's the fact that we only have enough food left for another few months, tops. The overseer keeps telling everyone to be patient, focus on work. He's definitely keeping us out of the loop. Something bad is going on, I just know it. Yeah, they're baby snatchers. The main door accessing the vault exit is malfunctioning. Now the only way out is through the overseer's evacuation tunnel. Well, that's good to know. How convenient for him. He has one of the science team watching the door into his office at all times from a little makeshift checkpoint. Got invited to a meeting tonight. Support staffers and security only. Sounds like I'm not the only one with an axe to grind. So I'm wondering if the security ended up killing um, some of like the scientists, maybe. Like, maybe a brawl happened. No all clear from Vault Tech is coming. We need to leave. We're all but out of food. I almost murdered Stanley for dropping a damn salt cracker on the floor. A handful of us confronted the overseer about opening up the vault. I never knew a man that that small could shout that loud. Now he's locked himself in his office along with the rest of the science staff. We're supposed to hand over any food, weapons, and medicine we have by tonight or there's going to be consequences. I've talked to everyone. It's time. One way or another, we're getting out of this vault. Yeah, so I bet you some kind of fight happened. Um... And that's probably what we're going to see. Oh, stim pack. I will take that. That's good. Anything else? Anything else for me to... Well, I can have a nice sit. Wonder glue. Free war money. Um, so the game is on PS4. I'm playing on PS5 just because I prefer the PS5 controller. Um, there's no graphical or, or performance improvements yet, but supposedly in 2023, um, there will be. Some PS4 games get a boost if you play them on PS5. Um, this one doesn't have it yet, though. Come over here. Ah! Squish. Oh, I can take his meat. Yummy. Giant roaches. What the hell? Well, we already saw him in the window. Why are you so surprised? This vault didn't even last a year into its deceit. Into its descent? Or deceit? Poor management, maybe. Uh, yeah, I definitely mean there's poor management, but it seemed like this was only supposed to go on for a couple months, like maybe six months, and then um, went on for much longer until the people just kind of uh, were like, hey, we don't have enough food. I'm just going to take that toaster, that entire toaster. 
Where am I going to put it? Mm, don't ask. Don't ask. I will not tell you. Death has many secrets. Overseer memo. Remember, use of the recreational terminal is a privilege. If work performance declines, this privilege may be revoked. Enjoy responsibly. Top 10? Top 10 what? Eject holotape red menace? Loading holotape. Future retro trophy earned. Oh my gosh, it's Donkey Kong. <laughs> no, he's shooting missiles at me. I did it. Oh, this is like a conveyor belt. Oh, oh come on. There's a great text-based adventure one, really. Oh, like my hair touched it? Finicky. I'm trying to figure out how to eject the hollow tape. Ah, it's mine now. Suck it. I stole it. I mean, everyone's probably dead, so... It's probably fine. Bed, sleep. I don't want to sleep on that bed. Is there any good stuff? Nothing? Nothing for me to loot? Okay. Um, that looks dangerous. I see you coming. Ah! <laughs> Fuck. Nasty. Oh, it's a skelly. What happened here? Where is everyone? I can tell you that Skelly's probably fine. And I'm death, so I'm an expert. Activate that Skelly. I know, I love how it's activate. <laughs> yeah, we're definitely not gonna go in there and die horrifically. I'm just looking to see if there's anything. Try CPR. <laughs> Look, if I could pick up the skelly and put the skelly in the chair, I would do that for you guys. But I can't. I want to power attack. Ah! Is that like strong attack ah! compared to this? I, I guess. Ah! Ew. Ah! Oh, crap. Ah! Radiation. Dang it. Gosh dang radiation. Had a little drink. It would be too much fun to be able to play with the skeletons. Oh, lots of stim packs though. Restore 30% of your max health, heal damaged limbs, can be favorited for quick use. Take this bobby pin. I think that's for lock picking, maybe. 
Select a favorite item with and press use it. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, gun, gun. Yes, please, gun. Well, we found Is another this skelly. All that's left. His foot, though. Oh, I guess this is... No, because it... Is this the overseer? This is the overseer's terminal, but I don't know if that's a security guard for the overseer. His foot was activated too hard. In Fallout 4, there's no fun allowed. <laughs> Great to start. So many of you guys really don't like this game, which is interesting. I thought it was well received when it came out, but maybe not. All right, overseer eyes only. Well, we already saw this. Cryolator. <laughs> Cryolator? I've long dreamed of making cryogenic freezing available in a portable on-demand form. <laughs> the Cryolator is my latest attempt. Thankfully, we're in no short supply of the chemicals and components I need to tinker with the prototype. It's a nice way to occupy the time as we wait for the all clear. Okay, so I think... I think these we already read on the other terminal. They probably just want to give another, like to put this here so that you're less likely to miss it. Because it does give some, some backstory. The final staff orientation is complete. All but a few of the residents down in Sanctuary Hills have been enrolled and several from Concord as well. Voltex supervisors came up this week to do a technical review with me. This vault is ready to open. I can only imagine what wonders our residents will get to witness. The notion of leaping forward in time. I almost wish I could join them and see the promise of our future realized. October 23rd. It's happened. We were lucky that most of the staff was nearby when the early warning came through. We had less notice than expected, but only Nordhagen was missing when we sealed the entrance. Resident admittance went smoothly. Everyone made it, even the family that waited until the last minute. Wow. I feel very called out right now. I was worried there would be more suspicion, but things happened so fast for these people, they must have been too overwhelmed to question the cryogenic pods. I question them. Strange issue today with pod C3. Subject appeared to be having heart palpitations. Nothing life-threatening, but unusual. We realized almost too late that the pod was malfunctioning. The cryogenic array almost started thawing her out. We're not sure, but I suspect a hiccup in vault Tech's remote override systems may have sent an errant signal. We'll have to keep an eye out. I hope I hope their systems are reliable once we evacuate the staff. Is that mine, then? There's been no all-clear signal yet. Even though we're nearing the end of the 180-day mandatory shelter period, supplies were never intended to last much more than that. And despite my best efforts, people are begging to people are beginning to question what we're doing down here. If people think we can just leave when the 180 days are up, they're insane. The radioactive exposure would still be potent enough to fry everyone if the vault seals are breached that early. The whole point of the all clear was to receive additional instructions from the main office. I don't know what to do. I can't open the vault. I can't expect our supplies to last forever. I just have to keep everything under control until the all clear. Mutiny. I knew it. A faction led by the security personnel have turned on me, demanding they be allowed to leave the vault. Idiots. I will not open the door to be irradiated to death out there. I'm consolidating the remaining supplies, putting the staff on lockdown. We're going to have to start prioritizing who deserves what little food we have left. I've been too damn generous with the rations. If people don't like it, well, that's fewer mouths to feed. Open the, okay, open the tunnel. So we'll probably need to do that, but I want to look around first. I'll take that, and that, what's in here? Nice. Coming back later for you. Cryolator case. Unlock master. Oh, uh, well, I guess I'm not a master yet. Am I going to remember that the sweet gun is in here, though? So, I guess this is like a freeze ray, essentially. Because I think that's what he was referring to in that um, message.
Incompetence and ego, the standard reasons for a group dying. Yeah. I think a lot of people like it, but the nuclear apocalypse setting slash 50s style architecture aren't really my thing. That's fair, Brianz. I'm not really a fan of the 50s aesthetic either. I kind of like it a little bit more in Bioshock where they have the advertisements, you know, they're very, um, very kind of like old school, but it's funny because they're talking about pretty much magic, <laughs> magical powers almost. Also, Bioshock's whole thing is basically being able to um, kind of experiment without regulations. So they sort of moved ahead. Ooh. Whoa. With what you could do um, with science and such. All right. So we need to open this. Really enjoyed four, but Bethesda usually divides a lot of people. That's fair. I could go on a huge rant about how this is a bad Fallout game. Damn. No, I liked it. I mean, there are a lot of memes from it. Fair. All right, open the tunnel. Personnel evacuation tunnel is now open. Remind all staff to be orderly and follow shutdown protocols before exiting and resealing Vault 111. Please maintain all staff records and research. Report to your local Vault Tech superiors for a debriefing and further investigation or instruction. Well, what if everyone's dead, though? Because I have a feeling everybody, everybody's dead. Ah, so now I can crouch. L1 to target enemies and vats. To mark a target for attack, press R2. Guns can target specific limbs with L. Okay. Boom. Can I only do one at a time? Which nearby enemies with... Oh, is that with Bumper? I think it is with Bumper. I don't know how to melee. Can I melee? Yeah, I was trying to switch back to the baton, but that... It's not... It's not working. Oh, there we go. Now that I'm super radioactive, I don't really want to use all my bullets on these. Later on, you can queue up attacks on parts. Okay. Gotcha. All right, let me look at this. Let me press, okay. Let me press X then. It's not just pressing it on the directional pad. Beaky beaky. While hidden, you do increase damage. While my sneaking failed, he turned around. This always happens to me when I sneak. I try to be stealthy, Is and then the person alive? turns around, and I have to shoot him did in the face. Did anyone get out? Uh, Sean did, it would seem. Pretty sure he did. Oh, take that. Ha! Ah. Okay. And this just opened that door. We were already back through there. So, we don't need to go back there. Everyone's dead. 
well, we are death, so we should have foreseen this properly. Um, excuse you. Oh, his hand came off. Well, I guess this is mine now. Just need to shake free this scaly hand. No holotape found. Well, I can put one in there. Change tabs with R2 or L2. Okay. Death. Quests out of time. Yeah, it would seem. Nope, no radio. The thing looks so uncomfortable, doesn't it? Reminds me of the bracelet from The Mummy Returns. <laughs> like, we can just never take it off now. Just my life. Here we go. We'll push the button. Oh, I wonder if I could plug a Sega controller into this thing. Lunatic Goose. Yeah, this is Fallout 4. Welcome. Dega does what vault can't. Finally getting out of the vault. We still don't know for sure what year it is because everybody was dead, so it, we could have been frozen longer. Change name, special entry. No, I'm I'm ready. Enjoy your return to the surface, and thank you for choosing Vault Tech. Not just dead, they were skeletons. They were. They were. I can breathe. Well, that's fine. Skelly, skelly, skelly. Lots of skellies. Excuse me, skelly. Take those Nuka Cola. Take the first aid. The folder. Excuse me, Skelly. Well, this is fine. Just like I remembered it. Ah, home sweet home. <laughs> okay. Press L3 to sprint. Why is there a fork in the mailbox? Are 
army fatigues. I wonder if that would be better than what I have. Well, we can certainly loot everyone now. Stealing everything is really going to bite me in the ass when I reach whatever weight limit, inventory limit I have. Completed. Go home. This is my home? I don't think so. I don't think this is my house. My house was over here. Oh, Codsworth! As I live and breathe! Oh, it's... It's really you! Everything's dead. Oh God. They did it. All that fighting, and for what? Everything's dead. Everything's dead? Ah, yes, the, the garden. Uh, the posies have been problematic, I admit. If only Sir were here to help. Where is he, by the by? They killed they him. They killed him. Oh, Mum, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a, handy. a distraction to calm this, <laughs> this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Oh, well, here Checkers, we go. Or, or perhaps charades. Oh, Sean does so love that game. <laughs> is, is the lad uh, with you? He's a baby. I don't think he understands the concept of charades. Well, maybe he does now. Maybe he's 35. I don't know. Sean's been kidnapped. Sean's been kidnapped. Where I'm do you think I had? Where was I hiding him, Codsworth? I'm going to get my baby back. It's worse than I thought. Mm -hmm. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> um... Pardon me? 200 years? What? Are you sure? A bit over 210, actually, Mum. It'll take a little for the Earth's rotation. I bet Sean is a robot or something then, because, like, <laughs> he wouldn't feature in this game unless he was <laughs> important. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. You must be famished. <laughs> Ego death. At times, people will withhold information or caps. You can attempt to persuade them into sharing both. You okay, buddy? Codsworth, you're acting a little weird. What's wrong? I... I... Uh, Mom, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years years trying to keep the floors waxed but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood <laughs> nothing and don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house <laughs> and the car the car how do you polish rust stay with me pal focus I'm afraid I don't know anything, Mum. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were, were dead. Well. I, I did find this hollow tape. I believe Sir was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. Hollow tape. Uh, thanks. Thank you, Codsworth. He has not called me death yet. Now, I'm upset. Enough feeling sorry for Did you guys lie to me? Shall we search the neighborhood together? Sir and young Sean may turn up yet. He was shot in... Sure, maybe. I don't maybe. know, Codsworth. I... Follow me. Oh, Codsworth. The dad was unimportant. He was in the game. Yeah, but he clearly didn't have a purpose in the plot. Can we just appreciate this? 
God's work. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna take my own toaster though. Can Codsworth die? I don't know. He's in the denial stage of grief. He's been in the denial stage for 200 years. Get him, get him Codsworth. Oh, well, you got him. I'll just let you handle it then. Oh, there we go. He finally called me death. Codsworth. Miss Death. Sir and young Sean. They aren't here. That's okay. Thanks for trying, Codsworth. You can't keep up, Mum. What about the city? Concord is nearby, and, well... The people there have only shot at me a few times. Why are they shooting you? Thanks for your help, Codsworth. Good luck, Mum. You'll find young Sean. I know you will. I shall remain here and secure the home run. There's nothing... No, you should come with me. There's nothing here. Land, ew, and meat. Gross. Um, well. You just say you're useless? Oh my god. No, we're gonna be nice to Codsworth. He deserves... He deserves that. Anybody else, though? I don't know. We'll have to make that decision. As it happens. Where'd he go? Just very funny to me that there's a skeleton in there. Y you know, you could have used a real one. Codsworth. Ah! Oh, a casual outfit. It's probably the ugly one from earlier. How do I open up the pit boy? Is it square? It's not square. Circle. This gives, I think, charisma? Perception, this gives strength and agility. This gives damage resistance, though. Probably want that. Codsworth is already the cinnamon bun. Everyone else is potentially getting the bin. <laughs> yep. All right, so our kid was kidnapped 200 years ago. I'm not sure we can do much about that. I feel like maybe we should focus on making a new life in um, paradise here. So much garbage. 
But you know what? Someday we might need that garbage, so... Investigate Concord. Where is... Oh, Concord's down here. Press X anywhere on the map to add a marker. Okay. But well, I'm pressing X. I want it to be on here. Maybe it'll just show up on the map anyway? Well, it's close enough. It has a waypoint? Oh, okay. I see. Yeah, it's that little symbol. Alright, to Concord! Oh, I don't know if I want to touch the water. That seems like it would be icky and not good for me. Let's see if we can go around on the bridge. Water bad. <laughs> well, this car barely got touched. How did this one survive? Look at all the other ones. The water is probably fine. Um, somehow I don't believe that. What do we have over here? Um, is a tire iron. Okay. Take that uh, meat. Oh, he's naked. Well, that's fine. He doesn't need his clothes. They're mine now. Was that the missing dog from earlier? Better not be. I do not believe in that theory. I refuse. Red Rocket. Greet the do <gasps> Is this my dog? Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? Oh, well, he's obviously not mine if I'm asking about the owner. You seem like an okay guy. Okay, then. Let's stick together. How did you survive, buddy? Face your dog, press X to begin issuing commands. Hey. He's a smart boy. How you doing, buddy? Can I name him? You wanna play hey fetch? Boy. Think you can find something for me? I see if there's any good stuff nearby, boy. And you said, is this my dog? And Rue growled. <laughs> Because that's what you say when you're trying to toss his toys for him. Yeah, that's what I say when I'm about to take his stuffed dog to throw it for him. How you doing, buddy? Best boy. Hey, boy. You know any tricks? Aww. Hey. Good boy. Alright, come on, buddy. Betty's just gonna follow me. This dog can die. I'm gonna be pissed. Whoa! Naked mole rat! Holy crap, they're everywhere. Hey! Stay away from my dog. I will kill you. I'll beat your head off, apparently. Ha! Get fucked. Okay. See if he had anything worth taking. <laughs> yeah, go check the rest of him. Why am I taking his teeth? You good? How you doing, buddy? Be Never good. mind, boy. He can't literally after they showed him off in the o original E3 announcement, they immediately said he can't die because in 3 in New Vegas they could die. Well, that is an improvement in this game.
Hey there, buddy. You kind of got to go. There you go. There you go. Giddy up, buttercup. Back leg. Oh, well, I have that. And rat poison and cram. I don't like spam. Oh, crabs. Pipe pistol. Wait, when did I pick that up? I can rename the weapons? I don't know. Oh, the tire iron does more than the security baton. I should switch them. Hmm. Comfort grip. Companions were a thing in two. Superior sighted accuracy, better focus and sighted accuracy, maybe that. That seems good. Moving parts can pack a, a pinch. Keep your finger out. I'll try. Weapons workbench. Oh, workshop. The workshop allows you to build, adjust, and remove nearby objects and structures. Hmm. Yeah, I don't really think I want to do that right now. I like this stim pack, though. Power armor station? I can't craft anything here. Oh, I never played this. <laughs> I never played this hollow. No, no, little fingers away. Uh, there we go. Just say it. Right there. Right there. Go ahead. Ah! <laughs> Yay! Hi, honey. Listen. I don't think Sean and I need to tell you how great of a mother you are. But we're going to anyway. You were kind and loving and funny. <laughs> That's right. And patient. I'm hilarious. So patient. Patience of a saint, as your mother used to say. Look, with Sean and us all being at home together, it's been an amazing year. But even so, I know the best days are yet to come. There will be changes, sure. Things we'll need to adjust to. I'll rejoin the civilian workforce. You'll shake the dust off your law degree. But I have a law degree? Do, no matter how hard, we do it for our family. Now say goodbye, Sean. Bye bye. Say bye bye. Bye, honey. We love you. Seems convenient that he recorded that shortly before everyone died. Isn't that nice? Wow. 
five and seven. This is it. Oh. Yeah. Babies don't talk on command like this. Uh, they don't. I'm gonna switch over to the tire iron because it does a little bit more damage. And also this, uh, we have this pistol too. Okay, I can favorite it. Choose a slot on the favorites menu and press X. I'm trying to take it off of favorites, but... I wish I knew where that music was coming from so I could turn it off. I trust nothing. Where's it coming from? Shut up! Stop. All right. Okay, so the tire iron, that's it, that's in favorites, that's favorites, that's favorites, okay. So we're good then. Effing radios, I know. Same problem with Bioshock. always gets claimed no matter how hard you try. Can you imagine how absolutely disgusting those cigarettes would be? <laughs> Just like anything consumable or that you would put in your body. that wrench. Huh. No, I want the cats. Yes, money. Oh, rad X. Join or die. What the heck? Normal thing to have in a gas station. Plastic wrap protected them from the radiation. <laughs> Business entries. Oh my goodness. New equipment installed. Finally got all the tools you need to machine our own parts. No more having to pay for, Cor for Corvega factory parts. Okay. That's... There is a window. The that Rosa widow in Sanctuary Hills is restoring an old classic Corvega with her son. Is that the nice car we saw? Nice woman, pretty kid seems kind of like a brat, but I guess that's the point of her doing this project with him. Anyway, she's been doing a hell of a job. I was amazed, amazed at how much her and the kid have been able to do on their own. The only reason she even came to me is because the engine is out of her depth. Sure, we can help her out. Jim, take care of these barrels before you leave tonight. Inspectors are coming first thing in the morning. Just hide them with the others. We'll figure out a longer-term solution later. Hey, if nature's going to favor us with a cave right below the shop, who am I to argue? Hmm. Could be something interesting in there, or it could just be death. Replace the brakes in a 2075 Fusion Flea Supreme. Monthly service on the Voltec van. No major issues with the vehicle, but that rep is an uppity asshole. Well, he is dead now. Probably. Or maybe he's a ghoul. I feel like he's the kind of character that might come back as a ghoul. Began work on a late model motorcycle. Pre-atomic. What seemed to be simply a sticky throttle turned out to be more serious. Turned out to be more serious issue with the cables. They're almost all completely degraded. We'll replace with platinum parts. Coolant leak is one of th in one of those new 2077 Corvega coupes. Bubble top. They don't make them like they used to. It can't be death since you're not in there yet. <laughs> Place the automatic alternator in a 2073 Corvega. Okay. Well, we did learn that there's a cave. And there might be some good shit in the cave. Come on, puppy. Let's go.
Was that an actual Nuka Cola or was it a bottle? Chemistry station. Bleed out syringe. Um. <laughs> Great. We can just make drugs. Um. Let's find this cave. Two hundred year old milk. Yum. <laughs> That's definitely uh good. And we have an armor workbench. But we can't do anything. Oh, well, I found me a nice hard hat. I guess I could put that on. Cooking station. Ew, baked bloat fly. <laughs> Mutt chops. Mole rat chunks. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, we could. If only we had iguana bits, we could make iguana on a stick. Disgusting. <laughs> I mean, might as well. Might need it. I don't know what else this meat is used for. Probably more cheese than milk by now. I think it's beyond cheese. That milk. All right, come on, pup. We gotta find a cave. Aha. Well, we found it. They didn't really do a good job hiding this, did they? I mean, it's right here. I'm not very good at uh, hiding their secrets. Why does it say mole rat den? I don't like that. Oh, this looks very poisoned. Am I gonna get radiation? I'm watching. It has a green cast. Got some nasty mole rats in here. Brain fungus? Pardon me? Oh, hey, I leveled up. Harvest the brain fungus. Do I want that? Let's level up. Um, oh, requires these to get to these. Hmm. Iron fist, pickpocket, toughness, cap collector, bands, gunslinger, fortune finder. Hmm. Well, I think I'm doing better just hitting stuff, so maybe we want to go more melee? Strength is a measure of raw physical power. It affects how much you can carry in the damage of all melee attacks. Now you instantly gain one point. Maybe I'll do that. So I guess you only get one point. Maybe they'll give us more as we level up. I'm not sure. But. Hey, puppy. Can I accidentally hit him? Because I'm worried about that. I don't want to hit him. This is a drippy, drippy place. I would absolutely not be going in here. 
This seems like an infection. Uh oh, rads, rads, rads. That's not good. You've taken radiation damage. Okay. I guess from being near that thing? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna just move. Try to avoid that. See if there's anything else in here. Corn! Oh, we got some good stuff in the duffel bag. I thought that was a body bag for a second. So, um... That's good. Why do I need this brain fungus? Left arm bones? Yeah! So you're saying I could have been taking that this whole time? From all those skellies? Can I use it as a weapon though? Ah, oh, come on. I found a Molotov cocktail. You're gonna tell me I can't use someone's arm bones as a weapon? Like, come on. That would be hilarious. A little fucked up, but hilarious nonetheless. I'm assuming what he was talking about was in the duffel bag. I'm gonna run anything in here. Ooh, quick, quick, quick. Anything? Nope. Okay. Alright. Let's get out of this gross place. I know a game where you can use a skeleton arm as a weapon. It's pretty funny to see. The only one I can think of offhand is medieval. Oh, feels good to be out of there. I feel like if it were me and I had gone through all of this, I would definitely not enjoy enclosed spaces. You know, after being shoved into a little cryopod. <coughs> What'd you find, buddy? <coughs> hey, what? Where's it going? Wild mutt fruit. Okay. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. What'd you find? Oh, he opened the door. What a ch what a well-trained dog. He can open doors? This is a floor. You can't really dig that. Ah! Do you find Won't a be safe? Able to break this. Well, oh, what a good boy, finding that safe. How you doing, buddy? Good boy. Stay safe, buddy. No, I'm not dismissing him. No, I don't want to dismiss him. Come on, boy. It's time to go. Oh, Bobby Pin. box of bobby pins. We need to learn how to pick locks. Hem box. Oh, I tried to stop him from going back there, but I think he did. It's not too far. Breath of the Wild lets you use skelly arms, if I recall correctly. I think so. So where is he at? I didn't mean to dismiss you. Come back. said he was coming back here. Where is he? 
There he is. What are you doing, buddy? Hey, boy. Everything okay, boy? Come on, boy. It's time to go. He's getting gas? <laughs> I guess so. Okay, well... Come on. We're gonna have to go back in here once we can lock pick. Ooh, cap stash. <gasps> Nuka Cola Quantum. You guys remember when they made that? But it sold out super fast and so no one could really get it. Entering Concord. Um, well, this is a place, that's for sure. Yes, I couldn't find a bottle. I literally went to every Target in my city. Aw. Yeah, we tried to grab it too from Target, um, but no one had it. I'm assuming someone probably just came in and bought them all. Because that's how these things go. Well, I saw a big bird. Galpers leave nothing untouched. Yeah, they really don't. I'm sure there's one floating around on eBay. Bone cutter? there were and they were so overpriced that does not surprise me that was several years ago now did everyone die here too oh no Whoop, that's not what I meant to do I meant to crack Oh. Caution. You gotta reload sometime, asshole. Maybe if we just wait, they'll kill each other. been detected. Hey, don't shoot me in the ass. But especially don't shoot my dog. Oh, well. What's going on over here? Um. What's up here? A glow sighted pipe rifle? Molotov? He's fine, he's napping. Ugh, expert? You expect me to be an expert? I just got here. Well, that happened. Oh, you should not be up here, buddy. Well, we're up here now. I am afraid of fall damage. 
because I'm sure it exists in this game. Hmm, what's the likelihood of me breaking my legs if I jump down there? Pretty high, probably. The stairs made you dizzy? No, shit. Woo! We're fine. <laughs> it's fine! Hey, up it's here. all good. I've got a group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, please! What the f- What? You're yelling at me through the wall. I can't hear you. It does and broken bones, uh, I figured. Doggo's right here, Doggo's fine. Cool. When freedom calls, enter the museum. Look, I'm trying to j bust through the window, which is not happening. Oh, let me just, let me just take a seat. <sighs> Right here, next to my friends. Nice sit. Okay. Did they kill that one? No. Alright, maybe I can get in through the back. Doggo jumped off the roof from the look of it. Well, luckily for him, he doesn't have fall damage. I, on the other hand... Do. Wait, puppy has fall damage too? Well, I guess I have to just go in the front door. Whoop. The fact that they were moving made it 100% funnier, the skellies. We made it. But I need to level up. Oh, there was a gun? Oh, shit. He. <laughs> I guess I triggered it because I was too close to him through the wall. Um. Ranger. Commando. Black Widow, come into my parlor. Men suffer plus 5% damage in combat and are easier to persuade in dialogue. I feel like we should do that. Wait, I can't... Can I... I don't have to... Do I not have to do the earlier ones? Can I put these anywhere? You have the requirement? Oh, it requires... I see. Charisma, too. Okay. Hmm. Who needs friends anyway? While well, adventuring without a companion, you take 15% less damage. No, I want to travel with Doggo. Bloody mess. Plus 5% bonus damage means enemies will sometimes explode into gory red paste. <laughs> I mean, I kind of want to do that one. <laughs> um, as an agent of death itself, you can instantly kill a sleeping person. Hacker, attack dog. Oh, locksmith. Oh, I need more perception for that. You're an agent of yourself. Does that mean that I need to put... So I would need to actually put one of these into perception to then be able to unlock some of these perception ones. So that's how this works. 
you're a creature of the night. Gain plus two to intelligence and perception between the hours of 6 p.m. and 6 a.m. Some of these are kind of funny. Um, science. That are critical. There's a lot. Party girl? There's no chance you get addicted to alcohol. If you max them out to 10 first, when you pick up the bobblehead for the stat out, it'll go to 11. Hmm. Ooh, cannibal. Should we be a cannibal? Feast on mortal flesh to heal your wounds. Eating human corpses restores health. Should we be a cannibal? Num, num, num. Ghoulish. Sure, you're still human on the outside. Radiation now regenerates your lost health. I don't know. Some of these endurance ones are pretty fun. Um, I'm going to start with Black Widow. And then we'll need to put more in these ones. We can get other things. Hey, Stargazing. How are you? Depends on, depends if everyone's a skeleton. There's not a lot of meat on those. Maybe we can, <laughs> there's bone marrow. <laughs> Dargazing, yeah. we were just debating on whether or not we should, if we should be a cannibal. For you. I don't. I can't go through there, so I guess we gotta go this way. No more British occupation. I'm too with you. This is interesting. Why are they naked? Why are you naked? Oh shoot! He dropped a gun out there for me. I think I should go get that. Wow, an interesting life choice. <laughs> okay, you said he threw a gun? Oh, here. Short laser musket. Laser muskets can be charged by pressing square repeatedly. The more charges, higher the damage. All right. The dog meat duplication glitch really made the shit system less tedious. You could duplicate the year special book until all your stats were at 10. So you, I take it then you preferred the other level up system. I'm gonna go ahead and favorite the laser musket. Put it there. What's up, pup? You're okay. He doesn't like the animatronics. I don't blame him. I keep pressing uh, circle to crouch just out of habit. Not circle. I'll take the skull and the switchblade. Pup knows danger. Pup knows danger. He back up over here. Oh my, <laughs> uh, oh, I shot his head off. Can I pick up his head? Aw, come on. 
I was just so spoiled when we were playing Dishonored, you know? How dare you kick my dog? You fucked. You take all your clothes. the simplified thing worked for the Elder Scrolls because you level up stats by using them, but in Fallout it was based on a traditional RPG system. So now you have to spend levels to increase stats or get non-combat stuff, all the while enemies scale. It's tedious and unrewarding. That's fair. I can see how that's an issue. Oh, I don't think I'm reaching. Hey! You motherfucker. Pupper, no! Pupper, come back here. You okay, buddy? Heads up. How you doing, buddy? Never mind, boy. Look alive. Wait there. Why don't you stay here? You don't want Pupper to die. Yeah, I know he can't die, but I don't want him to get hurt either. Grab anything useful. Well, we already got everything, so. Check it out. That'll teach him to hurt the pup, that's right. He sure learned by being dead. See if there's anything there. Go back over here, I think. Eat that one. <laughs> See, if I were a cannibal. Come on, man. They ain't going nowhere. We got other shit to deal with. You hear that? I gotta go take a little walk. And I'll be back. Don't be dead. Dandy boy apples and a skull. Light him up. Oh, well. <laughs> Dead. You fucked. Good job, pup. I'll see you later, Wildcat. Thanks for hanging. Watch. Well, at least we have a decent amount of stuff to sell whenever we find a place to sell such items. Man, I don't know who you are, but your timing's impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minuteman. Uh, nah, that ain't it. Minutemen? So now I'm traveling backward in time. Protect the people at a minute's notice. That was the idea. So I joined up, wanted to make a difference. And I did, but... 
things fell apart. Now it looks like I'm the last minute man left standing. Well, who are these people? Just folks looking for a new home, a fresh start. I've been with them since Quincy. Lexington looked good for a while, but the ghouls drove us out of there. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. It's just me, the Longs, Marcy and June. That's all Mama Murphy on the couch. And this here is Sturgis. Hey. Tough break. You don't know the half of it. Anyway, <sighs> nope. We figured Conquer would be a safe well, place. Well, I've been to in settle. cryo for 200 Those years. Proved us wrong. So, but I mean, well, we do have one idea. Well, let's hear it. Sturgis, tell it. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind. He doesn't a get subtitles, I guess. Sweet goody. We're talking a full suit of cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. That's some serious protection. Oh, it gets better. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? And I can use the minigun like a rifle. Don't see why not. It'll have a manual trigger. Just aim it at the bad guys and do the old spray and pray. Now, as for the armor, it's out of juice. Probably has been for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. Why isn't the subtitle disappearing or changing? I don't know. <laughs> I'll help if I can. What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement. Locked behind This guy just doesn't gate. get subtitles, I Look, guess. I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. I don't know. We'll see. Well, it's not a no. Look. Maybe. If you get to the fusion core, jack it into that power armor, and grab the minigun. Then those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. I'm waiting to accidentally shoot one of these people. We're fine in that. Careful, kid. There's something coming. We need help. And we get a vault dweller? What are you going to do angry. in that stupid jumpsuit? Bleed to death? Alright, now I might shoot someone on purpose. Ma'am. Now look who dog meat brought to us. He's a good dog. Smart, too. Oh, indeed. Dog meat's good at finding folks who need him. And he'll stick by you now. I saw it. You saw it? It's the chems, kid. They give old Mama Murphy the sight. Been that I way don't think that's what drugs do, ma'am. What's the sight? I can see a bit of what was and what will be. And even what is right now. Now, uh, and right now, I can see this something coming, drawn by the noise and the chaos, and it is angry. What is it? What is it? Mama Murphy, I need more. Please. I'm I'm Persuasion sorry, attempt kid, failed. I'm very persuasive. But I just don't know. The sight ain't always clear. But believe me when I tell you it ain't a radar. 
See you later, Cortana. Thanks for hanging. <sighs> but I'm tired now. Is he wearing a necklace and I ain't bullets? mistaken. You've got a job to do. These are our lives we're playing with. Are you listening to me? Can I help you? Oh god. Ooh, perception god. bobblehead. Why, 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 are you saying I should why, wait until I max it out so before I take it? Well, that thing's broken. Hey. We can't just stay trapped in here. This is ridiculous. S somebody do something. Why don't you do something? Mister? Oh, no, 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 no. All right. I'm tired now, kid. The sight takes the vim right out of me. Ma'am, I think you should stop using drugs. Look, Sturgis may be big, but he ain't much good in a fight. I need you to do this. I'm reading this. You've collected an issue of Robco Fun. Includes the Atomic Command holotape game. I don't know what that did for me. The object is already in use. Well, go away. Oh, handy. Select a potential password with L. Press X to enter it. If your chosen password is incorrect, the number of letters that match the terminal's password, both letter and position, will be displayed on screen. Is it hand? Got it. <laughs> Unlock security gate. Did it. Make it quick. They mass for another attack. I won't be able to hold it. I mean, are you going to pump hours into this game and finish it? If not, I would just go with the immediate boost. It's I mean, yeah, instant gratification. I have this now. Ooh. Mine. So, You're with the rescue team? No, no, no. no, no. Uh, no. All right. Get a fusion core. All right, I guess that's what we're working on. Okay. Good, it didn't kill me. Uh oh. Nope, still fine. Duck, go, in a bench. Lock tight. Ding. Also, if you select blank areas contained with the brackets, you can remove wrong answers. Okay. Up here. Boss! We got somebody up here! Nope. You got nothing. You saw nothing. Got nothing. Wait, is it in there? What rescue team? Uh, yeah, good question. Who would be running that at this point? If you hold, I want to say circle, you can turn on the light. Oh. oh, flashlight. 
Does it? It doesn't consume batteries or anything, right? Like, do I have to? I don't have to be aware of that, do I? No. Okay. No more Good. British occupation. Put to England with you. Have your key back, you. This seems like quite an interesting... Oh, there! Oh my gosh. Well, this is mine now. Put it in the power armor. Okay. Mm. Is that also down here? Go around. No more British occupation. It's colors based on the Pip Boy colors, so you can make it to be other ones. Oh, cool. That's nice. Jump. Hmm. Yeah, there's a little V that means, oh, that means above. So it's on a higher floor. So it's like up there. Okay. Thank you, that makes sense. I just gotta get back up there. Oh, there's a guy that we undressed. Remember that? I sure do. N nope, not there. Here. No, not here. The only problem with games like this is everything looks the same to me. Know what I mean? Like, the color palette and everything, so then I get lost very easily. Like I am now. I know I jumped down from there, but like, how do I get up there? That worked. That is not how I got up here the first time, but hey, it worked. So I'll take it. Oh, do I need to be on that side? Are you kidding me? Hmm, I don't think I can make that jump. Huh? I think I will break my kneecaps if I do that. Ain't nothing wrong with a bitch. 
kick. Don't okay, I think that's how I was supposed to do that. Aha! Uh -huh. There we go. Power armor transfer. Well, I want to put this in there. And now I guess I want to get in there. Oh, it's just like when I was in cryo. Mm, puppy is fine. Power armor reduces incoming damage, prevents all damage from falling. said I wouldn't take damage from falling. Should I just jump down there? After you undress your fifth body, they start looking identical. A little bit. Hey, puppy. YOLO? YOLO! Yeah, that would scare the shit out of him. What is going on over here? What is that? It says clear concord of hostiles. You can sit up there and snipe it. Oh, death claw. That's a death claw? That doesn't sound good. Move, puppy. You gotta get out of there, buddy. This bitch. I will kill you. Took his hand. All right, Papa's Papa was fine. Pupper, he good. You good? Look alive. You good? How you doing, buddy? Hey, boy. You know any tricks? Good boy. All right. Doug, I look like you got yeeted by Deathclaw. Well, who's laughing now? I took the Deathclaw's hand. So. We win. Check that out. Back patch. I don't think I was supposed to go down there. Well, I'm in here now. Are there any raiders in here? There's a skelly. Hugging his sugar bombs. Oh, he's, he's 
Scuttling away. Oh god, he's up here. Pupper, let's go. We're not supposed to be here. I know you said the dog can't die, but I'm still very worried about the dog dying. It is still stressful. Damaged and destroyed power armor pieces can be repaired at a power armor station or replaced in the pit boy. Well, that's good to know. seeing any raiders that are alive anyway. Oh, that's all we had to do. I thought we were gonna have to take out raiders along with the death claw. I guess he just killed everybody? Well, that was efficient. Celebrate history. The dog rompers alone would make me be unable to play the game. I'd be too worried about the dog then playing. Easy, mama. You okay? I'm fine. That is understandable. What's up? Hey there. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you're on our side. You should be. You guys gonna be okay now? Yeah, for a while anyway. We can at least move some Listen, when we first met, you asked about the Minutemen. One thing you should know about us, we help out our friends. So here, for everything you've done, thank you. Ooh. I'll take what I can get. <laughs> Spoken like a true merc. Well, if you ever feel like fighting for something other than yourself, you should meet up with us in Sanctuary. I could use someone like you. Someone who can get things done. Doing what? What would I need to do? You'd need to stay strong like you've been. Because there's more to your destiny. I've seen it. And I know your pain. Ma'am. Destiny. My destiny? What do you mean? You're a woman out of time, out of hope, but all is not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. Where is my son? Where is Sean? Oh, I wish I knew, kid. I really do. Well, then you're not useful, not are like you? I can see your son. I can just feel his life force, his energy. He's out there. What if it's my son's Even son's son? It has been 200 years. You should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. What's in Diamond City? Is Sean there? Look, kid. No, of course he's I'm not. I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The site will paint a clearer picture. Is this just is this just her way of getting Murphy drugs? Talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Well, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the site. And our new friend here, well, she's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can hardly oh, hold turn on, out hold any on. worse than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? 
Anybody? Well then. I just got here. I don't sanctuary know. Sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Bet it won't. Come on, June. It's time to go. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Leashes? <laughs> She's a fake. She's not getting vision. She does have premonitions. I'm assuming that's what she, when she was talking about the, the big thing coming, she probably meant the death claw. Almost every companion hates when you give her chems. I'd imagine if you give her enough, she'll probably die. That'd be my I'm assumption sure anyway. We can handle anything we find until we reach sanctuary. What if I just give her something and tell her that it's drugs? That's at the end. That's the end of her line. She'll die. That does not surprise me. That seems pretty much where that's headed. I mean, Preston basically just said that. I guess we're all going. Don't forget the price we paid to get this far. Let's move out. I'll take okay. point. Stay close, everyone. No, follow my behind, armor. Do do do. This is gonna be a long road if we're walking this slowly, Preston. Mm -hmm. Still can't believe you took that thing out. First time I've seen one of these things up close. I'm very glad it's already dead. So, what are they supposed to be? The death claws? Like, are they a mutated animal? Like the rad roaches and stuff? Where you going, pupper? You just went in there. What you doing in there, buddy? They're horribly mutated gym bros. They're just super fit. If I recall correctly, and they haven't retconned it, they were a lab experiment that also got mutated and radiation like all things. Were they- so were they human? Was it a vault experiment? That would make sense. Okay, Preston, can we go a little faster? Hi. We need to keep moving. Well, you're slow though. Okay, you're moving very slowly. I don't know where I'm going, but I'm... No, they were just a creature. Oh, okay. Where are we going, Preston? Don't worry, June. Just stay with me. They can turn invisible? Thankfully, that one didn't. I found a cow. This just solidifies my stance that if the world ends, I'm not going to live through it, so I'm not wasting my time preparing. <laughs> Stargazing. I mean... <laughs> I don't know, yeah, some of these apocalyptic worlds are so bleak. I'm like, I don't know, man. That's, um... Are you real? Your oh my gosh, you guys. Service. Could be some good salvage in there. Let's get to Sanctuary first, though. I think we're close. Mm -hmm. The only reason they exist is because a West Tech facility where the FEV was created was directly hit by a nuke, which irradiated it and spread it. Where is the bright, joyful, apocalyptic world to show more creativity in writing? I mean, that would be a very interesting take, wouldn't it? If instead it was, you know, bright and colorful and... I'm always glad to see the sun come up. That would certainly time. be a surprise. 
that's Nuka World, kind of. <laughs> that seems like a Willy Wonka parody waiting to happen. Well, I'll be Nuka damned. World. It's the monument to the original Minuteman. I knew that was somewhere around Concord. That means this right here must be the Old North Bridge, where the first shots of the American Revolution were fired. I'd call that the best omen I've seen since we left Quincy. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about, boss, but I'm glad you're happy about it. Thanks for the history lesson. Beginning of the game, the apocalypse actually saved the world from an even bigger apocalypse, and now things are better than they've ever been. Preston, you are... You could just walk on the good part of the bridge. What are you doing? I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? I lived yeah. here. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... <laughs> 200 years ago. Here. Over 200 years ago. I, I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. So ghouls Anybody can live that make long? It out with you? Maybe. I woke up at one point. Some people killed my husband and kidnapped Grandpa. my son. I'm trying to find him. Damn. I'm sorry. I love how he I just believes me. I mean, I guess Let in me the apocalypse, if, if things got this anyway, shitty, you would just be like, yeah, sure, why did. not? But <laughs> I was expecting him not to believe me when I said, yeah, 200 years ago, I, I was frozen mind, in a pod. But I've got another favorite. And he's like, oh, damn. I've had word from a settlement <laughs> asking for help. There's still hope in there are Minutemen out there somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is... I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out with the settlement? What kind of what help? What kind of help do they need? Sounded like the usual. Raiders. You'll have to get all the details when you talk to them. <laughs> fine. I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. That's not what I said. I said fine. Maybe use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. He looks so dead inside. I mean, I think we're all a little dead inside if this is our reality. Ghouls are basically a myrtle, at least from aging, but not like, you know, bullets. <laughs> I didn't realize that they were... Oh, you found something. What'd you find, buddy? Oh, thank you. A bouffant. A bouffant? What? Why can't there just be a pet command? Well, we have a few things to do. I can't look at my inventory when I'm in this thing. But I can level up. Hmm. Gonna do endurance training. I just really want to become a cannibal. Aqua girl? You no longer take radiation damage from swimming, can breathe underwater. That would be useful. Adamantium skeleton? So I would be Wolverine, is what you're saying. I need eight endurance for that shit. You embody wellness, instantly gain plus 20 maximum health. Hmm. I mean, why not? There's no law left to judge you if someone does judge. Just eat them, too. <laughs> yeah, exactly. 
Now listen, I've got this huge fucking Gatling gun and I'm walking much faster than all you fuckos. <laughs> ah, yes. Back in my house. Uh. Hey, Codsworth. I have some friends and a dog now. At least it's not raining. I mean, that is good, I guess. Where are you going, Preston? Did you? Okay. I don't know where everybody else went. I'm supposed to talk to Sturgis? That was one of the quests. Codsworth. Pupper might be stuck. Oh no, he's fine now. Where did Codsworth go? I thought he would be in our house, but guess not. There he is. Well, not Codsworth, but Sturgis. Hello, hey, Sturgis. You willing do to you do have some work? work? We what need. What kind of help do you need? Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground for too long. Why can't you do Why it? Why do you need my help to build beds? Look, we got a lot on our plate. Look, I'm good and at hitting things, shooting things, food, soon eating water, things. Shelter. I'm not a carpenter. It. Well, you asked how you could help. I told you. Did you mean it or not? Fine, whatever. I'd be glad to help. Okay. Good deal. Just make sure we can sleep with a roof over this guy our Sky found hair gel in the Some apocalypse. I'm impressed. still look solid enough to do the trick. There's a workbench over there you can use. Give me a holler if you need anything. Build beds. All right. Oh good. Well, thankfully I hoard everything, so we have plenty. We can build these shitty ones. Wait, why isn't it letting me build these? I have the materials. Am I missing... Am I missing a uh, hello? <laughs> Am I missing a skill? Because it says requires something. He uses motor oil for his hair gel. I can't even build the crappy ones. Hmm. Can I go steal beds from other houses and just put them here? I feel like that should work. You know? I also wish I could- I found someone that could take some of this stuff. The town crafting part, this ruined me. Oh, meaning you did a lot of this, Tim? Well, can you help me figure out why I can't make beds? I have stuff. It says... Well, it says five cloth. 
And I have 59 cloth. You may have to... Oh, is it because I'm in the armor? Well, then. Fine. Um. I don't know how to get out. <laughs> this is my life now. I left for a bit. Now Kita's a robot. I am a robot. And I don't know how to not be a robot. Hold circle. That. I don't think so. I think that's the light. That's a gun. <laughs> Did you try placing the bed in the open? Well, I can't make it. I knew you'd join us here, kid. Well, of course you did. Of course you knew. I'm sure you're trapped. I am trapped. Yeah, Square just uh, does that. You only knew the Xbox controls. It was in the bench clipping into it. Oh. Oh, I thought I had to build it first and then I... Okay, thank you. Here's the bed. Can you... Can you move? I will build this bed around you. My suit will run out of power. Oh, shit. Uh... Well... Mm, it's not either of those. I, I, I You're gonna have to take company, it off. I, I don't know how. <laughs> ah, hold X. I did it. Look at that. I did it. Why am I so slow? Is it because I have too many items? I feel like it might be. Damn it. Well, I'm... Do materials count for weight? I need to build more beds. Guess I could build a nice one. I'd build, I'd build a shitty one. Well, whoever we like the least gets that bed. You can store all your junk in the red workstation. Oh, and it'll let you access it for crafting. Cool. Okay, there's a nice bed. Um, there's a shitty bed. So I can store stuff in here. Ah. Store all junk. <gasps> Look at that. Oh my god, that was so much weight. <laughs> it was like a hundred pounds. Oh, I can move again. Okay, well, can I get rid of this shitty? No. They're, they're both sh They're all going to be shitty beds. It's the apocalypse. Okay, we're doing what we can. Um, I don't, I also don't know where the hell to put, oh, I sh should I have been putting these in the actual rooms? Probably. Oh, I know. I'm going to give your bed um, right here next to the toilet so that you can get right up and use the toilet. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's smart. And then your bed. <laughs> your bed can be right there. And then your bed can be. Um, your bed can be next to the stove, so that when you're hungry, you can just- You can fry eggs right from your bed. And that- see, it's multitasking. You can sleep and cook at the same time. Oh, I can scrap stuff. You know what I'm gonna scrap? This radio. No radios. No radios. We just can't. This couch was just flipped. I feel like they could have flipped. They can flip these chairs. 
Why is this my job? Well, I'm just going to scrap it. I don't care. Yellow outline means it's junk, while white means it's a thing. Oh. Okay. Scrap. Scrap. Oh no, now it's becoming now it's become house flipping simulator. Now I'm just gonna clean. Scrap, scrap. Welcome to the rest of the stream. Listen. You would think some of them could do this, but they can't. I like that it just, like, puts the... It just puts everything in the workbench. Hello? Do you like your bed that I made you? I worked really hard on it. Uh, could you move, please, so that I can... Can you... I need to scrap. If there's loot in it, it goes into the bench too. Well, that's nice. I don't think that's doing too much there, buddy. Scrap. 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 It's a bedroom now. That is a shitty chair. Scrap. The question, of course, is where are we going to store food since I just scrapped the fridge? Told you this became a problem. <laughs> Scrap. 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 Well, look how much better this is already. Kickball. Who needs food? Yeah, good point. Who needs food? Oh, good. I'm glad the tire wall is just one thing. It's like, please don't make me. Okay, our armor workbench is here. Well, I don't want it there. I want it over here. Can I... I feel like I can put it here. Right there. I want to be more against the wall, but... Mm. Good enough. It's not outside anymore. My stupid armor is just going to sit there because I put it in the worst place possible. That's fine. Look, it looks so much better in here now. Isn't that nice? Ah. If only we had Codsworth. He could really help spruce the place up. But I don't know where he went. He is gone, sadly. So I'm assuming this means I can just basically do this with everything here. No mailbox for you. Can I oh my gosh, I can scrap the whole car? Wrap everything. He's in one of the houses? Oh, he wasn't in my house. Goodbye, stove. Hmm. 
He's going to be confused when he comes in here. And all this is gone. <laughs> and be like, where did everything go? He is going for minimalism. Yes, I am. There's a green wall that's the border of the settlement. Okay. I am going for minimalism. I'm actually just going for free stuff. You know? So, if Sean is still alive, then he's probably a ghoul, right? I mean, it's been 200 years, and uh, Mama Cocaine said that she felt his energy. So, he's probably a ghoul. Or maybe he's a robot. Something. Something, something. We're gonna bring this back for Puppy. Puppy needs dog food. Here we go. Put it right there. There you go, buddy. I don't have any food for you, sadly, but... I ain't got a bowl for you. Goodbye, tricycle. We're gonna have so many materials, guys. I can clean up the wood. Uh. Okay. I just scrapped that whole house. Fuck that house, I guess. Oh, where was that one that was, like, completely destroyed? There was one that was, like, caved in. Marie Kondo approves! <laughs> Does this spark joy? No. Get out. You can totally rebuild them all? That's pretty amazing. Oh my gosh. Get out of here! I'm in build mode! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Can I delete him? I'm gonna murder your face! I still have this. I will kill you. I will murder your face. Get him, doggo. Get him. Good job. Okay. Holds. There we go. Scrap. Beautiful. Scrap, scrap, scrap. Scrap. See this one? Oh, this one's just scrap too. I thought we might be able to fix that one. So I thought that's what that one, um, uh, I don't know what they're called, email? <laughs> Was referring to? Can I build a new car? Oh, I can't move it. I was gonna put it in front of our house and be like, look at my nice car. But I can't move it. It does feel so much cleaner now, doesn't it? Gotta get rid of that toilet. Puppy needs his own house. Oh my gosh, I would love to make just a house for the dog. This is a little cooking station. They're coming with me. Let's bring this back to our place. There was one that was straight up, like, you couldn't even go in it. And I don't think, I think it's... I don't think we destroyed it. Aw, look at him living his best life. Hey, I brought some cooking stuff. You're welcome, guys. What have you been doing this whole time? Fuck all is what you've been doing. Well, got rid of that house. Oh, feels so much nicer. The other guys can sleep outside. 
Oh, Codsworth is in here. And that's not our house. What are you doing in there? At least I'm pretty sure it wasn't. Oh, here. This is the one I was looking for. Okay, delete that. Delete that. Delete that. Ah. Boy, do I love spring cleaning. For a second, I thought that <laughs> the green border. Oh, doghouse. Look, this is perfect for dog meat. You're coming with me. Doghouse for pupper. Oh, Codsworth. Hello. Do you want to help me rebuild the town? <laughs> He's looking right through me. Pupper. Okay. I'm just going to put this here for now so we find a better spot. Dogmeat is such a stupid name, poor dog. I want to name him something else. I would if the game would let me. There's a random guy you can encounter that sells guard dogs who you can send to settlements. Oh, really? That's cool. so much nicer now that we can just scrap everything more doggos love the idea of course we want more doggos bathroom stalled <laughs> like how the scrapping is instant? Me too. It's very satisfying. Oh, I can't scrap the gross corpse of this fly? Um, here's a skelly. Can I scrap him? He is spreading. Um, he also- oh, is that a gun? Excuse me, skelly. I'm just gonna take that. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks, buddy. curious what we can no radios i'm curious what we can make now because we have a lot of materials ew can we just nuke this house put those in here how do we get rid of those He's using the dog bed. Look at him. Look at him. He's so happy in his dog bed. He loves it. Perfect. Codsworth, where'd you go? I should have I should have talked to him when I saw him. I should have. He's just roaming. The dog makes you so happy, as he should. He's a good boy. Best boy. No radios. No ugly rugs. Ooh. Aw. Oh. It's just telling me I can scrap that. Unlock. Adjust the bobby pin with L. Use R to turn the screwdriver. If the spot you've chosen is correct, the lock will rotate and open. 
If the lock resists, release R and use L to reposition the bobby pin. Maybe. Oh. Maybe. Here. Carefully. Maybe up just a little bit. Oh, come on. You're close. Got it. Ah, look at that. Take all. Thank you. So if I had scrapped the safe, would I have gotten everything in there? The skill level for the post-apocalyptic world is too high. That really was the exact same as Skyrim down to the sounds. Oh, that's how you lockpick in Skyrim? Um, hello? Why are you in my old house? This isn't my house. That's a, that's a lie. But yes, it is. Get out of my house. <laughs> All right. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Hey, Codsworth. Miss Death. Welcome Hello. back, Mum. I do hope you were able to find some assistance in Concord. You can New say friends, that. meaning the dog. I made a few new friends. Can't have enough of those these days. I realize that I'm no Mr. Gutsy, but if needed... I'd be honored to accompany you throughout the Commonwealth. Just say the word. Come with yes, me. Yes, of course. Right behind you, Mum. Not to worry there, pup. Your mistress is in good hands. Oh. I can only have one at a time? Codsworth tolerates you. Wow. I feel like he should like me more than just tolerating me. I end up deleting everything people can sit on except for approved spaces because people wander off and I need to find them. <laughs> That's smart. Okay, so we've got... Airplane seats, benches, an ottoman. Why would we want this broken ass chair? That looks fun. These also all look like you, um, probably wouldn't actually want to sit on any of them. Containers. Hmm. Containers and shelves. A magazine rack. What would we even put in that? We have some tables. Magazines and comics. So I guess I could take the comic that was from my house and put it in there. And then miscellaneous. A bathtub. Oh, a bobblehead stand. So I can put my little bobblehead that on there. That toilet does not look... in use or that it could be used hey Codsworth well I would say we did a pretty good job can you change the exterior probably not 
Nothing is clean and it's it upsets me, Umbria. <laughs> yeah, I'll set it down and be like, oh no. It still looks bad. <laughs> See you later, Amfu. I hope you feel better. rug is horrible and going away. Far away. Who needs street lamps? Oh. Go away. Hey there. What's up? I knew surges would find something to keep you busy. I wonder what Diamond City will be like. If the name has anything to do with it. it must be quite nice. Does more oh, trash spawn or is this I it? Know. Hopefully it doesn't. I would assume not. But I don't know. Do I need to talk to him now that I did this? Okay, where he's over here. Apparently. Hey, I did the thing. Hey, Sturgis. I like it. Having a place to sleep will improve everyone's spirits. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. Drink from the river? Uh, I don't think what that's do a good idea. Like a well. They will not have to keep drinking God's the river water. Hanging out. That stuff's not good for you. Do we need to make something? Oh yeah, guess so. Oop. I can make stairs? My tummy's growing. I'm gonna need to eat some food. We got some. Oh, a half eaten door. I love that look. <laughs> Man, The Sims sure looks different from what I remember. Mounted creatures? Signs. What signs? Employees must wash hands before returning to work. Employees only. I kind of want to make these. Put them around. Honey waffles. <laughs> Missed opportunity for a collab. The Sims Apocalypse Edition. Anyway. Eat Otronic? Hmm. I love how a crib is considered a miscellaneous decoration. We could put in a Nuka Cola machine. No, no juke boxes. A meat bag. What? A meat bag?
Hmm, I wonder if we make a generator, if that's how we can use things that require electricity. Defense, guard post, tur ooh, traps. I wanna put a turret. Yo. <laughs> how can I decorate without using meat bags? That's a very good question. Oh, I need power for my turrets. Bleh. They could still intimidate people. Oh, there's different kinds of turrets. Heavy ma a laser turret. Oh, I don't need power for these because it says requires two here, but these don't have that requirement. I can make these ones. Power is only for laser, more advanced ones. I feel like we should put this near the bridge, you know? Be like, hey. This would be great defense. This one right there. Your defense value is too low. Oh, when your defense value is too low, the chance for attacks on your settlement increases. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, we have turrets now. Resources, okay, so that water. We need a water pump. Um, yeah, that requires power, so we could just put that there. Provide clean water. Very impressive that your character knows how to make a functioning auto turret from junk. I know, she's pretty great. Put one back here. There, now we have clean water. Corn can only be placed in dirt. Corn, a gourd, a melon. <laughs> Miscellaneous scavenging station. Byron, fast travel, okay. Yeah, clean water. Yeah, I'm not sure anything is clean. Where'd he go? Sir, where did you go? Don't make me take away all the chairs. I will take away your chair your chair privileges. You are just all the way out there sitting. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take all the chairs, damn it. Hey, I did it. Hey, Sturgis. I feel better. I feel better already, knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. I hope you don't mind me asking for some more help. But our food supplies are running low. What have you uh, been doing this whole time? Here, now? You've been sitting on your get biscuit. Some crops established. What, kind of, what kind of crops are you looking for? Well, it doesn't much matter. Potatoes, mute fruit, corn. Potatoes. Whatever you can get to grow. Potatoes. <gasps> oh, puffers over here. Well. How well does food grow in irradiated soil? Um, that's a very good question that we're just not going to think about. You know? We're just not going to think about it and hope for the best. As you do. Can 
I am glad that I can take those flamingos, though. I would love to put those outside our house. This looks like a good spot for crops. Melon. Well, there's already melons here, so perfect. Let's add some corn. You must assign a worker to this object before it can be producing resources. I didn't know I could do that. I don't know how to assign someone to work on that. I don't know if we want Mama Murphy doing that. There Let's trade some things. No, I don't want to trade. Just find a nice spot of ground and plant whatever you've got. I did. Maybe I just need to plant them. I just don't think I have any other food to plant. I definitely thought that I had mud fruit, though. I definitely thought that I picked some of that up. Oh, you got the wild kind? Me. Picky. Well, everyone's gonna starve then. It's not my fault. It just happened. Well done. I have leather armor. As long as we can feed us and the dog. That's right. And the melons will do for that. <laughs> That's all we need. Forty-five left arm? I don't even know what that is. Oh, you must be in the power armor for that. Did I accidentally take that from the power armor? Very possible. Maybe I should give it back to the power armor. Broken O. It needs to be repaired. Because it was broken, it got dumped in your inventory? Okay. Do I need to fix it here? No. I kind of assumed I could fix it at the armor workbench. But... I don't think so. I 
quite a few. Weapons. So Mama Murphy, you're tied to this place, kid. Your energy. My energy. My energy. What do you mean? Thought I told you before, kid. I saw you leave that ice box. I know your pain. This world, it's not yours. But here you are. The site can help you, kid. It always has answers. Just gotta bring me some jet so I can see what it wants to tell you. What's jet? It's a little inhaler that packs a big kick. They say it makes you move faster, but at my age, it's more of a quick rush. The chems fuel the site, so it's not always gonna be jet I'm asking for. But that's what's on the menu this time. Hmm. Maybe. Let me think it over. Well, it ain't like I'm going anywhere. The site will be here when you need it. Hmm. I don't know if we want to do that. <laughs> cool off the drugs, Grandma. Talk to the settlers at Ten Pines Bluff and go to Diamond City. Well, I guess we could just leave and try to find some crops while we're out. I don't have anything else. I planted what I had. That's it. Godsworth, are you coming? Are you stuck? Hey. I'm all in. Hey, Codsworth. What is it, Mum? Your thoughts? The past, the present, and the future walked into a bar. It was tense. What? How do you feel about us? Well, things I look could like the scarecrow better, from Mom. Batman. It would be nice to see you back to your old self again. This is how I've always been. That was all I had. All right then. This is how I've always been, Codsworth. You should know that. You should accept me. Mm, yeah, we're gonna use the bridge. He can wear bowler hats? Oh, I want to get him a sick hat. Can he wear any kind of hat? Because I have a different hat. The puppy wouldn't judge you. That's worth. Miss Death. Only a couple types? Why well, have a hard hat? Would he wear that? No, put it on. Put it hey, on, Codsworth. Hey. Can now I'm just disappointed in you. I don't have a bowler hat for him. Will he wear mole rat chunks on his head? It would say equip. Oh. Would it say that in here? Like in my inventory? Or would it say equip when you talk I to him? Hi, 
Hi, Rue. My doggo wants attention. Hi, buddy. Over his inventory. Dog me can wear bandanas and goggles. Oh, I don't have any of those either. Dang it. Okay, he's coming along. Slowly but surely. I guess we want to go this way. That's wild fruit. We can't plant that. Apparently. Well, took that. Cotsworth? Yes, I'm hoarding. Of course I'm hoarding. It's just who I am. I don't think we can go in there. I'll see you later, Lucy. Thank you for hanging out. Thicket excavations. There's a person down there. Are they friendly? Probably not. Oh, that's a fall. I think if I'm careful, I can... Mm. If we just go down here first. Then go down here. There we go. And go around. I don't know if that person's gonna try to murder me, though. Gotta be ready. Are you a foe or a friend? Well, he's not attacking Unless you're gonna me. pitch in here, keep a distance. I'm gonna steal your stuff, actually. Excuse me. Looking to earn some cats? I Maybe. could use a hand here if you're all done gawking, you know. Ask for I could money. probably help. For a few caps extra. Just had to push, didn't you? Fifty caps. Take it or leave it. Help, with help what? you with what exactly? I'm trying to fix this old water pump. Should be plenty of scrap in here. If I can get it drained out. That sounds like Garrus. Is that Garrus? <laughs> I need to know. No, what are you really up to here? <sighs> like I said, for scrap. Mind your own business. You helping or not? That, that has to be. I can what help. What do you need help with? Uh, the pump isn't in top shape, but... It should at least start. There must be some leaky connections flooding me out. Think you could fix them? The leaks will be underwater. Look for bubbles, and you should find them. I'm telling you, that's Garrus. It is? That's what I thought. I can't believe that's his actual voice. I thought they put, like... Some kind of filter or something on it. Underwater in the toxic wastewater? Um, yeah, you know. It's fine. Perfectly fine. Repair pipes. I 
Maybe they dug right into a spring. Yeah, probably not a good idea for us to go in there, though. Hmm. We would need an upgrade or maybe a different suit or something. Because otherwise we'd probably just die. And we don't want that. Dirty water. Mm. Okay. Nope. Nope. This way? Nope. And... Nope. Oh. It's always like right at the end, too. When I think it's done and it's not. Nice. There we go. Who knows? Maybe the water can give you superpowers. I'm yeah, I'm sure. Very carefully. Nope. Oh, come on. I've been being very careful. Is it more this way? That's it. Ah. Shipment log? Hmm. Writing holotape. Sully's log. Great spot with the right crew. I'd have no problem keeping this place locked down. Traders run close enough for easy pickings, but not so close we end up skinned. Whole damn thing's filled with water, though. Figures. There's always a catch. Big ass drainage pump looks mostly intact. If I'm lucky, it might still work. Gonna take a closer look tomorrow. Nope, not gonna be that easy. Still, pump is in better shape than you'd think. I'd like to head back and grab some tools, but it's pretty late. I'll tinker with it some more before I bed down tonight, then head out in the morning. Shouldn't be too hard now. Glad I grabbed the sledge, even if it was a bitch to carry all this way. Thing was rusted tight. Few good wax with the sledge cleared the, that problem right up. Thing thing made the damnedest sound each time, though. You'd swear something was moving around in there. Uh-oh. Was able to make most of the connections. Patched up all the pipe leaks I could find besides the one in the water. All the noises I've been hearing. I'm not setting foot in there. I'll probably head back and drag one of the new guys over here and make him do it. Aha! Ah, ha. Huh. There's something in there that wants to kill me. I'm stealing your shit. Oh. <laughs> I've I've run out of juice. Me, the robot. So I'm going to have to disappear. Oh god, nightmarish. <laughs> hey, Consworth. Getting a little close there, buddy. What you doing? Hmm. Well, this is not something we can do. Right now. Or rather, we shouldn't do it. We probably just shouldn't do it. At, at this time. Maybe if we get the Aqua Girl... Boost... We would be able to, uh, do that. 
He's very quiet, and that makes me suspicious. back now. All right. Still looking for food. Oh. Hello. We have a mutant doggo. Two mutant doggos. Oh my god. Codsworth. <laughs> On guard. Glow in the dark dogs. No, the glow is not coming from the dogs. Where's another one? I don't know where it went though. The glow is this. Glowing fungus. That's what the glow was. There's the other one. Oh my gosh, Godsworth! Caution, Mum. I do for pound you. <laughs> Nice job, Consworth. He's uh, pretty adept. Not in work, but wouldn't want to leave the good stuff. Oh, we found corn. It does say wild corn. I think that means. I hope that still means we can plant it because we couldn't with that fruit. Less stressed having Codsworth because you know he can handle himself and I worry about Pupper. And what do we have in here? Well, I found it. What's all this? <laughs> hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, out. Well, he did it. Good job. It's all that repressed rage from being left alone for 200 years. <laughs> Codsworth is finally like, yes, I can let out this aggression. Ooh, tato plant. This I can probably. I thought I could plant this. Aha. Uh -huh. I'm taking this all. Hope they don't want this or need this, cause uh, it's mine now. <laughs> it's all mine now. Lots of potatoes. Got a workshop. Hello. <clears throat> Wake up. Hey. Hello, I stole all your food. What do you want? We don't need any more trouble around here. Yeah? Is it because I have the tire iron out? Didn't you ask the Minutemen for help? You're with the Minutemen? I didn't really think you fellas still exist. That guy doesn't know what to do we in the back. <laughs> one of them passing traders, but honestly, He's like, mm, I never expected anything I'm going to back come. to bed. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days after Quincy. Bad business, that. Who's Quincy? 
Is there something you need my help with? Whew. Yeah, I'm damn glad you're here. There's a raider gang that's been giving us trouble for weeks. Stealing food and supplies, threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. We know where they're coming from, but we can't go up against a gang like that. I'll kick their asses for you. No problem. <laughs> Thanks, friend. If you folks are for real this time, it'll be a welcome change for the better. Okay, well, have a good day. I took all your food. Kill the raiders in the Corvega assembly plant. I wonder how far that is. Potentially far. Does this game have any kind of fast travel? Arrow. Okay. Arrow to what? It would be helpful if you gave more information. You can go to any location you've discovered. Oh. Well, as long as you aren't in combat. Where's Sanctuary? Oh, up here. Okay. Oh, and it shows me where I left my power armor. That's good, because I would have forgotten. Well, that guy looks fun. Well, I'm here now, so I guess I can plant the food that I stole. Potatoes! And you guys didn't think we'd be playing a farm sim. i just throw some over here. Good enough. Heck is he? Oh, he's inside the doghouse. Um, okay. Uh, so I, I got us food. Oh, <laughs> he's. Um, Sturgis. sir, well, this place I need is to starting speak to, feel to you. Like home. Now that we can grow our own food, I think we can really make a go with this. Trouble is, the more we He's establish a mutant, ourselves here, kill him. the more of a target we become. What we need is to get some defenses set up. Then maybe Preston will be turrets. able to relax a little bit. What sort of defenses did you have in mind? Walls, sandbags, turrets, whatever Where you can put together. That. It was like the Sturgis. first thing I did. Thanks for doing that. We'll all sleep better at night knowing we have some defenses set up. It's been a long road. But yeah, I think this is it. Home. Hey, I got a trophy. And I leveled up. Born survivor. Hmm. Damage resistance. 
I feel like that would be useful. I mean, we could you we could do the Aqua Girl one. You no longer take radiation damage from swimming. Animal friend. With your gun, aim at any animal below your level and gain a chance to pacify it. Hmm. We can't be a cannibal for a while. Disappointing. Hey, Soothsayer. How are you? Apocalypse's end goal, cannibalism. <laughs> I mean, that's my goal. Nerd rage? They seem pretty fun. Working from home today, so I'm able to have your stream playing as well. Oh, that's awesome, Sooth. Uh, I'm not sure how much longer we're going to go, but uh, the VOD will be up. You want to see from the beginning. Go ahead and do the water one. No longer take radiation damage from swimming and can breathe underwater. That seems like it would be useful. Because I feel like I could absolutely accidentally fall in the water. We'll probably try to do this now. You become a mutant. Now you're j more justified in eating people. Hmm. I don't... Why isn't it showing... This mission on the map? It's like, where did our crops go? I don't know. It certainly wasn't me. I did not take the crops. Can't blame this one on me at all. That's for sure. Codsworth. He's coming. He's coming. <laughs> Damn, Codsworth. Missed Jet. Think anything good? 
Yeah, I took his meat. Wrecked. <laughs> he does, though. Uh, hello? Excuse me. Hey there. You look like someone who could use a dog. Woman's best friend, too, right? No. <gasps> Why are you selling? Why are you selling her? Oh. I don't want to. But I love dogs, and I gotta make a living somehow. So I raise them and sell them. I'm always blue for weeks after that I guy's sell beard. One. But then I get myself a new puppy and start all over again. How much money do I have? I don't care. You've got a deal. Oh, yeah. You sure? I mean, she's a great dog. Don't get me wrong. I just don't want to sell her to anyone who isn't going to take good care of her. I'll take care I'll of take her. good care of her. Don't worry. You know what? I changed my mind. I don't think I want to sell her just yet. I think he might also be Garrus, but... Hey, pupper. Aw. Well, later when I have more charisma. Eat him and steal the dog? <laughs> what a weird reputation I would be getting. I wish, wish this mission would show up. I can't remember exactly. Um, hello? Are you gonna attack me? me? Oh? Codsworth. They already left. I think we need to go down here. I think this is where it was. Now that we can just go in the water with no problems. Perfect. You've collected an issue of taboo tattoos? Permanently unlock a new facial tattoo? Okay. Why well, have this now? Oh, stim pack. Good question. Taking all of this. I'm sure this is going to be fine. In an old mine, too. I hear those are super dangerous to swim in. Um, yeah. Uh. Godsworth, come on. Come on. Come on. He's like, no, I'll rest. You, you survived 200 years without resting. Well, you rest in a little bit, but come on. I will leave without you, and then you'll have to somehow get down here. Oh, bye. All right, guys. Drinking water restores health. Drinking unpurified water causes radiation damage. Well, um, I'm a mermaid now, so I can do what I want. great if I could see better. Okay, the flashlight is not doing a lot for me. You're crazy far down? Well, yeah, I sure am. It just says repair pipes. I don't think it's going to give me more information than that.
I guess you only grew gills and not fish vision. Fish vision. No, I sadly do not have fish vision. Disappointing, really. You look for bubbles on the surface? Oh, yeah. You did say something about that, I think. I wonder how the quarry flooded. Rain Phosphorus. Or maybe you got they... down here somehow. Well, I got a makeshift battery. <laughs> Dang, and here I was hoping that being a, a mermaid. I wouldn't take any damage. Worth going all the way down here for? Okay. We're gonna fast travel out of here. And try this again. Once I get oriented. So we got some bubbles over there. Oop. Bubbles. Godsworth is just floating around. I'm not getting like a repair option. Oop. Very difficult to see. There we go. Oh, you just turn it. Okay. Okay, that's one. You need to grow one of those anglerfish head antenna lights. Uh, looks like there's more over there. 
Yeah, there's three of them. So there's one there. I wonder if you have to do them in order and then another one will pop up? Maybe. to look for Val to turn. I think it's right there. And that's two. Bubbles? Bubbles. No more bubbles in here. Worth, you just appear out of nowhere sometimes, man. Why is he not swimming in the toxic waste, too? He could have done at least one himself. He sure could have. But he said in his notes how there's something in, like, he was hearing a sound. So I think there's a creature that he doesn't want to deal with. I'm not sure where. Like, in the water somewhere, probably. I'm not seeing any more bubbles. guys seeing any oh there's some a mutated fish or croc probably at least they made them yellow now that i know what i'm looking for they're not too bad again. well we repaired the pipes Get out of the water. There we go. Hey, I did it. Maybe if I, I had to level up to do it. Take, I can get enough pressure. Hey there. That's a ticket. You do the honors. Hit that switch on the end of the pump. Mm. That's done. Just listen to her go. Wait a second. Did you hear that? Dang it. Get him, Codsworth. Still got some tinkering to do on this thing. Shouldn't be too hard now, though. Thanks for pitching in. Here's a little something before you clear out. Yay! We did it. And all we had to do was become a mermaid. A mutant mermaid. Goodbye, <laughs> Karen. Uh, all right, fam. Well, it's it's one a.m. I think. Uh, um, thank you for purifying the water. Hey, something you need, mom? Does he just have it in his inventory then? No. Okay. Well, um, I think I'm gonna call it here. But thank you guys for hanging out with me and for um 
give me a little bit of help here and there. I appreciate it because I am very um, new to Fallout. <laughs> he just makes it periodically? Oh, that's cool. Oh, you're welcome. They don't do tutorials very well. Yeah. I get that, though. I mean, I'm sure if you've played the other games, it's probably... It's pretty similar. I remember some things being the same from 3, but I did not play much of 3, so... But, thank you guys for hanging. I hope you enjoyed Twitch Miss Day 3. Tomorrow we will be back with something different. So, please join me for that. But, thank you guys so much, and I will see you guys tomorrow.